Ropa. The law was made when I was part of government the first time under President Kufo. The implementation of laws about our elections in Ghana are not the responsibility of the executive. The constitution of our country has given exclusive authority over electoral matters to an independent body called the Electoral Commission. And that is the way it should be. We don't want presidents and politicians messing up with the electoral system of our country. So it is the Electoral Commission through the mouth of Dr. Afari Jan, when he was chairman of the commission, who told us that they were not in the position to implement the law that when they felt they could organize it, they would. Well, we heard him. He's gone. His successor has come. She has also indicated once. I am saying to her, and I continue to say to her, I cannot understand why Guineans and Senegalese and Malians and Togolese can vote outside, but Ghanaians cannot, especially when the law is there. So we're engaged. But it is important that you add your voice to this matter for, the, for, for her and the members of the Electoral Commission to know that this is a matter of concern to you. You want to have this law implemented, hopefully, for the election of 2020. Let's all try and work towards that. And then looking at the, there is a commitment to review the dual citizenship law to see what can be done to do to limit the number of, uh, of places where dual citizens are, are, not, are ineligible. That commitment is there, and this parliament will look at that law again.